We are cooking in the van, you see? All of this. <laughs> oh, I really hope you got that. I did get that. <laughs> We're Chris and Sarah. A husband and wife creative duo. Five years ago, we met cycling across America. Three years ago, we got married, and our current adventure is traveling and working full-time out of our DIY Sprinter van. We're on a mission to live more meaningful lives by inviting other people along the way to join us in the adventure. We are Let's, Let's Be Us. us. <laughs> they had to have been like at least mid 60s and they had cowboy boots on and like leather tasseled jackets and cowboy hats on and you could tell they are out there having the time of their lives and I'm pretty sure they're coming from the bars and it's 11 a.m. So today we're in Nashville, Tennessee and it is my birthday. Actually my birthday was yesterday. We're filming this the day after the video you're about to watch, but stick with us. We realized we were gonna be passing through Nashville during my birthday and I called up one of my old college roommates, Polly, who owns her own cake decorating business because isn't cake what you're supposed to do on your birthday? And we baked a cake in my van yesterday. And we're gonna show you guys what that's like today. It's not our typical travel kind of vlog, but it is really, really fun. It's one of the most fun videos we've ever filmed. And I think you guys are really gonna like it even though it's a little bit different. Polly is someone that you should not follow on Instagram. Her pictures are too good and they'll make you very hungry all the time. Just, that's a warning. So Polly's really cool because she just started this cake decorating business as like a fun hobby and she ended up just sort of blown up. Like she's like functioning at capacity. So if you're in Nashville and you need a cake, she's probably the one to go to if she can get you in. She's in pretty high demand these days. Check her out on Instagram and now let's go bake a cake. Let's go. Let's make a cake. So what are we making first of all? We are gonna make a birthday cake. But what kind? Birthday. Oh, just vanilla. Funfetti. Okay. Vanilla funfetti. With funfetti. Let's do it. All right, what do I need to do? Okay. We can dump this in. Here, where's the um, bowl? Here. Can I bring a bowl? Oh, we did. Got one. Because you don't have a bowl, right? Uh, no. <laughs> so I got you. I okay, broke here. it. I did, and I broke it. All right. Go for it. Just put it. Oh, put the what in? The flour? <laughs> Is it flour? No, well, let's do oil first, right here. Oil? Okay. Yep. So is sour cream like a secret ingredient in your vanilla cake? Secret. Don't tell anyone. Okay. <laughs> Here you go. Dump that in. Let's go for it. Oh, you're. Oh, wow. Oh, see, that, that was very nice. Trick. <laughs> a little trick. Okay, and then buttermilk. Okay. Oh. And we'll do like three fourths a cup. All right, dump that in. Are you still pretty booked up for the holidays? I am. That's so good. I am. And this is my favorite. If you like a splash of this here, I'll take this from How you. How big of a splash? Just a big one. Watch me make sure. Just a big one. Just, oh, okay, that's a lot, but yeah, that's great. That's perfect. It's just gonna be very vanilla. It's gonna be very that's perfect. I love you did vanilla. You did a great job. Three eggs? Three eggs. And then we can put shells back in here. Good idea. You're doing such oh. a good oh. oh, I really hope you got that. I did get that. It's oh, okay. No. It's great. You're doing great. <laughs> <laughs> All right, round two. So what we're gonna do next, when that's done, is we're gonna sift our dry ingredients in. Oh. See, I've never actually sifted things when they say to sift it. I just sort of wing it. Does it make a difference? I usually don't either, but with cake it makes a difference okay. because all these clumps will stay clumpy and that won't be good. All so right, this and then important. we sift it into this? We are gonna sift it into this, yeah. <laughs> Um, and while that's stirring too, we can grease the pan uh -huh. with coconut oil. Oh. Coconut oil, okay? Do you guys have yeah. coconut? Yeah. Is that enough? Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's great. Okay. And then dump all of that. Okay, and then you're just gonna kind of shake it a little. Yeah, like that. Perfect. This should only take like 45 years. <laughs> <laughs> you can like, yeah. How many cakes do you have this week? 
um, this week, including this one, like four or five. Oh my gosh, that's a lot. Not a lot. That is a lot. That's a lot. It's, it's not as many as it could be. Is your are your arms like super strong? So strong. Are they really? <laughs> can you tell the difference? <laughs> oh, I feel no. like mine would be. <laughs> and then you're gonna start folding it. Yeah, fold just like that. Perfect. Folding different than stirring? Yeah, so you wanna just combine it just like as you're folding it over on itself. So around then you wanna stop. Because then? if you stir it too much, oh. then it'll sink when um, you bake it. Gotcha. Okay, you wanna put sprinkles in? Yes, I do. I think they'll all fit. So it does cook mm, fastest in the middle, but I'll try to keep them all on the side so it's just like, we'll, yeah, on that's okay. we'll just check on it. So normally they cook for 30 minutes, but I'll do like, maybe we'll check it in like 15. Sounds good. And rotate them. Yep. It's not because we're like bouncing around in here. <gasps> all right, oh, open it, open it. There it is. I think it's even moving around too much. I didn't even it's think right. about that. No, truly, it's fine. You're gonna turn out. Oh. Okay, butter. Butter. Frosting is all butter. Yeah. I love just, frosting. <laughs> just here if you want this, but I, it's already softened, so you're good to go. This is like a cooking show where they have everything already perfectly sectioned out. <laughs> where life is never really like this. Let's mix that for a little bit, for like a minute. And then here's a special, special hint. So we're gonna do like white icing. Um, and so to make white frosting, because our butter is yellow, so it's gonna look yellow, you do a little like toothpick size um, thing of purple. No! Isn't that crazy? Really? Special secret hint. So I'm gonna put that in there. I never and knew that. And then it will make it white. And then we're gonna do like a pinch oh. of salt probably yep. a lot more than that. Not a literal a pinch? A big pinch, like a well, giant pinch. After the dollop, perfect. Uh, I'm a little bit so we'll <laughs> unsure. Of vanilla, and then we're gonna do cream. Oh, when we're done, okay. So I'll we'll just leave you. that. I'll let you we'll eyeball open that one. That. Um, all right, then we're gonna start it. it sounds disgusting. <laughs> Squish, squish. Oh. So how did you get into this? Were you just watching a lot of the Great British Baking Show? Or? I started following this person called Baking with Blondie on Instagram. Yeah. Um, and she had these videos of her making cakes and them spinning round and round and round. Uh -huh. And I would just watch them. And then I was like, I think I can do that. Yeah, <laughs> you could. And then I started making some cakes and they were really terrible. Like, turns out I actually couldn't do it. Um, but then I think for my birthday, Zach gave this to me, and so then I started using it more and more and more, and then um, I just watch a lot of videos of people doing it. Yeah, I'm, like, I'm gonna try this, it. and then I'll try this, yeah. And then people started buying it, like friends would be like, hey, I'll buy this one from you, you know, for a birthday. Because we're making it really fast, um, because then it activates the whipping cream. And so it'll make like, essentially it's making like whipped cream on top of frost. It works. And it makes it like fluffier and lighter. We are cooking in the van, you see? All of this. <laughs> so what I'm doing is this one has um, like non-stick so it doesn't like fly off when we start spinning it around. Nice. And then when we're done with it, I'll peel this one off. Oh. This is just to keep it so like when we're scraping it, we don't want it to get caught on. Gotcha. That. Like that. Awesome. And then you're gonna pipe, like I'm gonna turn it for you. I would start on the outside. Oh. And we're gonna just like literally do like a spiral. Yeah, just squeeze it. There you go. Awesome, right. awesome, awesome. Look at all the sprinkles. It's so ah, fun. Okay. Perfect. So this, it really just helps. You can do this all with one hand. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so just that. Perfect. Look okay, and cute. then we'll put the next one on here. Right. And I, I flip them like upside down. Oh, they flatter? Uh-huh. 
yeah, we're good. So now what we're gonna do, this is actually really nice to get down right here. So we're gonna fill in all the gaps. So when we frost it, and then I'm gonna fill in this bottom part too. Oh, you are fast. <laughs> Oh well. We don't have this all day now. This is great. <laughs> okay, so. So you have to freeze it now. So now we're going to freeze it for like just 10 minutes or so. Well, that's not going to fit in my freezer, I can tell you that. Well, we'll take it to mine. <laughs> I think like you, for all. you were not in a Walmart parking lot. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little crooked, but you know. It works. It totally does work. Look at that! <laughs> okay, I'm gonna let you scrape some because this is looking so messy. It uh, am I doing that right? Yeah. The hard thing with sprinkles is that like sometimes a sprinkle will like kind of catch and then mm. it drags it through. I don't think I'm. What do you think? Yeah. What's your standard? Yeah. So what this is, this is just the candy melts smell like white chocolate. Oh, it does. AKA wax. Okay. Okay. So now what we're going to do is I have a couple different colors for you to choose from. I colors like this one. That's that I, my color. That's awesome. So right, maybe well. put a drop and see what color that gets you. Ah, uh, there it is. Okay, so now I'm gonna take this top off. So this just kept it like. So you just cut it off the top? Yeah, so I'm just gonna find. This one's fine. I think it's okay. Perfect. See how it keeps it oh, like that yeah. nice edge? Okay, so we're gonna pour that into this little pot. Oh gosh, let's do that over the sink. Yeah. <laughs> Not see on that your pretty. So you're basically, I don't know, always do it from the side, but you kind of squeeze it out over the edge like that. Oh, and then you'll just go, don't put any in the middle yet. Just put it like every other inch or so? No, you right wanna do it right beside it. And so if you squeeze a lot, it'll make a long drip. A little one will make a little drip. It's like the it's like the perfect colors for a birthday cake. Yeah, you know, like it is. It's happy. It's so it's my happy. color. It's your colors. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is little dollops around. Okay, the edge. So I kind of show you. You squeeze and you go like one time around. This is a little bit hard to do because that's frosting. I think it's hardening pretty fast. And then three, and then you kind of go down and then up. Well, oh, you want me to do that? I'm gonna have you do it. Oh, great. I'll do one more so you can watch. <laughs> we need to have one really good angle of the cake, so. This is great. All right, How your cute. turn. <laughs> right in the start there? Yeah. How do I get it? You got it. Sweet. You're strong. Thank you. Really good grip strength. <laughs> you got it. Go for it. Golly, Polly. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do that. That looks so good. Oh, look at that one. <laughs> They're getting shorter. <laughs> That was hold so, it. Uh, oh, it's so heavy. <laughs> yeah. That's so much butter. <laughs> <laughs> Look what she paint. made. We made it together. We made it. Here. Tell us what kind of cake it is. Give us a rundown. Funfetti cake, vanilla frosting with with sprinkles, then a little turquoise drip. In a van. Amazing in a van. Look at it. Thank you, Polly. Happy birthday. Thank you. <laughs> oh my gosh, it looks so good. Should we cut into it? Closing. Okay. But you cut it. You cut it. You've done this a thousand times. I think you should do it. Oh, me? I actually usually don't cut the cake because really? I hand them to someone. You know, they go out my door. So, how should I do this so it doesn't like completely fall over? Should I do all the way across or just pick out one I little would, slice? I would think I would slice the slice. Slice the slice? Uh -huh. Like one little tree? Or... Uh huh. Okay. I Good. love cake. Come on. There it is. Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh, that's so yeah. tall. Yeah. Oh, I made a mess of it. <laughs> Oh, it's look at beautiful. it. Beautiful. Oh. 
Oh, it looks so good though, Polly. Look, Look what you did. Look what you okay. Look at all the pretty colors though. I just amazing. love it. It makes me so happy. Amazing. It's good. I think it's good. You make a good it's cake. It's okay. You make it's a good okay. cake. Oh, well, thank you. all of it. <laughs> <laughs> that may be the best birthday cake I've ever had. Truly? Truly. So where can we find Polly's information? Very <laughs> well. Well, uh, on Instagram, Polly bakes cakes. We'll link it below. Polly bakes cakes. Polly. <laughs> is that what it is? <laughs> I just said it wrong. <laughs> you don't even know your own handle. You said it right. <laughs> Polly bakes cakes. Nashville, Tennessee. Nashville, homegrown in Nashville. All right, we're gonna go eat more cake. Be sure to give Polly a follow, and we'll see y'all next time.